Well, heads up if you plan to head out to the Montgomery County Fair tomorrow. As Natalie just mentioned, it could get a little nasty with a good chance of rain. Jenna Lee Bork is live from the fairgrounds now. So Jenna Lee, though, how was today? Well, people were definitely showing up, even though the, the humidity made it feel very hot out here. But I did notice that there were less people on the rides than you might expect. More people were staying in those shaded areas. I spoke to one man who's come to the fair his whole life who had some simple advice for avoiding some of the worst of the weather. When you're my age, you don't come out in the daytime. You wait till it turns, cools down a little bit. Excessive heat and a chance of rain tomorrow, putting a slight damper on the Montgomery County Fair that's going on all week. The executive director, Lori Page, saying the weather can impact attendance, but she says precautions are being taken. Jefferson Township EMS are there to assist anyone, and there are ways to get a break from the heat as well. We do have some um, shade on the grounds under the entertainment tent, and as you're shopping, there's several tents that you can actually stop by. There are several different areas where you can get water, and we do have water fountains in both of our buildings. The Montgomery County Clerk of Courts booth in Building 1 is one of the places you can get free bottled water. Page saying there are ways people can prepare before they head to the fairgrounds, like checking the weather ahead of time. If there's going to be anticipated rain, bring your weather gear. Um, if it's going to be anticipated heat and, and humidity, make sure you have your sunscreen, stay hydrated. And then if you're starting to feel a little bit, okay, it's just a little bit too overwhelming, make sure you get into building one where the air conditioning is at. Jack Warner, who's gone to the fair his whole life, says the heat is hard on everyone. It's hard, it's hard on the animals as well. But uh, there's a lot of shade. The barns are staying pretty cool, not too bad. So it's bearable. Warner says if you can battle the heat, it's worth it. Come out. You got to come out and see it. If you come out once, you'll probably want to come a second time. There's enough to see. You can spend two days here and not see anything twice. Jefferson Township's fire chief tells me they've treated seven people over the last two days, most passing out from the heat. So he says, stay hydrated and come prepared. The last day of the fair is Saturday. Back to you in studio.